Drop the knife. Put your hands up. Oh, it's shots fired. Good job, Rex. Got a half naked dude. Oh, they tased him in the ring. Gonna be a pursuit of a motorcycle southbound Buccaneer Way headed to the uh, port. Get out! Get out of the car! Get out! Oh, no, oh, no. Wow. He is not going in my car. No, no, no. everybody welcome back to another episode of lspdfr i figured today i'd do a normal patrol instead of the uh, realistic patrol i uh, just want to try something else out if you haven't guessed by the thumbnail already uh, we're going to be using the phoenix based police uh, these skins are by harrison 90 they're on all the cars in here uh, don't worry chicago's not going anywhere but i uh, want to take a break and do something different um, the cars that i am using most of them are by Maurice 97 with this uh, code 3 pursuit light bar I did change it to all blue and if you are from Phoenix and you hate the fact that I put all blues on your cars then this is probably not the video for you because I live in the south and down here we like all blues so I have all blues on there I changed the siren out I put the uh, PA 300 back in so I did that and uh, I switched the ped to this one by Pushy999. It's the Atlanta-based ped. So I've got, I've got, <laughs> I've got Atlanta-based peds, Phoenix-based cars, uh, South-based lighting, and to top it all off, we're gonna be in a city based on Phoenix, but we're gonna be next to the beach down in Vespucci. This is gonna be called the uh, most confusing patrol ever. So. <laughs> That's the reason for the title besides Phoenix Base. So, anyways, I hope you guys are going to enjoy this. And uh, let's get started. 1637 ready. You can show me 1041, 108, and available. Dispatch calling Unit 1, Lincoln 16. We have a traffic alert for breaking and entering. 1637 ready. You can show me now. Alright, so we've got an ANPR camera picked up, a license plate of a vehicle that the registered owner is wanted for b and &E or breaking and entering. So we're going to try to head over there and see if we can't stop that car real quick. And, uh, yeah. Uh, 16, 13, Attention so unit 1, Lincoln 16. Oh, Approach with that. caution. I got eyes on that vehicle. And he just ran the red light. Oh. Units reporting a criminal reason to arrest in the Spooky Canal. 1637, it'd be advised it's going to be an active 1080 priority hold the radio. It's going to be northbound Bay City Avenue. Uh, just crossing over Conquistador Street, and he blew the light at Conquistador. Speeds are around 30 miles an hour. Traffic is light. It's still northbound Bay City Avenue in Sandcastle. Uh, just blew the light at Equality Way. And just blew the light at Red Desert Ave. Speeds are 70 plus. Just took the light at Marathon Avenue. Alright, 1637 radio. Can we go ahead and get spike strips? Break check me. Oh, right, they're getting out. They're getting out. 1637 radio. They're, I need extra units. Assistance needed. And Put your hands. Get down on the ground, dude. Down on the ground. Down on the ground. 1637 radio. I got one at uh, gunpoint. Nope. Oh, what the hell? Jesus. Are you serious? That one hit. Put down on the ground. What is up? You shot- Oh, that's the other dude with a knife! Alright, 
1637 radio, go ahead and give me a few more units here. Holy hell, what does it take? 1637 radio, lots of shots fired. Go ahead and stage fire an EMS. This is dispatch. We are code four. No further units required. Let's go ahead and lock this scene down too while we're at it. 1637 radio, it's clear. Let's go ahead and get uh, fire an EMS out here. What the hell just happened there? Attention all units. Holy hell. And Del Perro, officers report a civilian shot. We have multiple injuries. We're going to go ahead and stop the traffic here, from, too. Um, I don't know what the hell just happened here. An ambulance requested from uh, I'm going to get a few more Hill units out here to help control the scene. He punched me in the face. Copy dispatch. Adam Moore en route. Wow. And, um, ambulance. I don't know why they're not coming in. They're supposed to be able to come in. Right, so hopefully they'll block the scene off. Right, I'll go ahead and stop all traffic now. That everyone's on scene. And I forgot to change the women bed. Well, this is a copy of the Chicago folder. Here we go! Oh, hell, not looking good. Oh, hell, not looking good. That sucks. I like the way it still didn't warp EMS inside, even though I chose it to do that. Damn it. Hey man, what's up? Is anybody gonna help me? All units, code no. four. Negative? Okay. Alright, 1637 radio. Go ahead and roll the corner out here, please. Alright, so the corner is in route. I got bodies everywhere, so I can't really move. Go ahead and remove everything. But I know the moment I do this, they're gonna start driving over everything. Hopefully this will stop people from running over bodies. You probably won't, but it's worth a try. So the coroner is here doing their part. I wish somebody would have came and uh, bandaged up my head. Yeah, what's cracking? And their car disappeared like usual. can disperse the scene all units return to patrol and then we will get rid of all the barriers at least I thought we were gonna get rid of all the barriers does that not work anymore Come on, move it. Oh, there we go all right <laughs> I need to take my car through a car wash all right 1637 radio I'm clear off that call you can show me code for 108 and available stop this car. This car set. That light was green for a hot minute before they went. So we're going to stop them real quick. 1637 radio. I get 28 San Andreas 05 Yankee Lima Sierra 505. Target license plate. 
zero five young lincoln sam five five a traffic violation a traffic violation right, show us Proceed showing that the uh, registered owner has uh, expired insurance and a suspended license or expired license i didn't see it completely so we'll hop out make contact with them see what's going on see if they are aware of the issues that plague their vehicle put the spotlight on if I can even see I don't think I can even see it nah so we'll turn that back off hey man what's up Hello. Like that's, yeah it's not doing nothing so alright so we'll hop out see what's up with them no, I don't need that we're gonna touch that tail light even though I have gloves on hey buddy how are you doing I'm Officer Garris with the Los Santos Police Department. The reason I'm stopping you today is um, that light turned green back there. You just kind of sat there for a minute. Kind of piqued my suspicions, okay? Then I ran your plate and it came back and you had expired insurance and that your driver's license might not be any good, okay? So that's the reason for the stop. Do you have anything in the vehicle that you shouldn't have just for my safety and yours? No? Okay, just for my safety and yours. That's all. No big deal. All right. Do you mind if I have your ID, Show me please? some ID. John Walker. All right, Mr. Walker and sir, can I have your identification too, please? Just want to know who I'm talking to. William Dust. All right, guys, sit tight for me for just a minute. Uh, for our everybody's safety, just keep your hands on the wheel, and I'll be right back with you, okay? All right, awesome. So we're going to go run their stuff on the computer. If it's just an expired license, I don't really care about that, unless it's, like, expired six months. That's when we start to have a uh, issue in the... Passengers, William Dust. I'll run him. Oh, his license is suspended. All right, so suspended is different. Suspended means that uh, he's not allowed to drive. His license has been pulled away. Failure to prevent present registration, which is also uh, an issue with the vehicle right now. No, no, it's not. So just no insurance. Now, see now here. Oh, what well, that's. Mr. Dust is an idiot. All right, so my game, my LSPDFR crashed, so I reloaded everything. Uh, however, their information is not back in the computer. But anyway, the driver of the vehicle is not the owner of the vehicle, and his license is suspended. The owner of the vehicle is in the passenger seat, and his license is expired. So he, I, either he does, doesn't know that his friend's license is suspended, or he's just an idiot and allowed his friend with a suspended license to drive thinking it'd be better than him driving on an expired license so however the issue is is now his friend is going to end up going to jail for that for driving on a suspended license so this ought to go over real well Let's see if we can go ahead and get him out hey buddy how are you all right man hey i got i got bad news for you man um <laughs> your license is suspended why don't you go ahead and turn around for him, put your hands behind your back. And that's not the original name that I had, but we'll walk you. Let's walk over here to the sidewalk for me. Alright. Alright, go ahead and uh, have, a, have a seat for me. I'll be right with you in just a minute. Alright, man, why don't you go ahead and stand out, step out for me. Does that not work for you? I guess not. See, it only works when it wants to. That stop the ped mod only works when it wants to. Go ahead and hop out of the car for me, man. All right. All right, man. That is so irritating. Whatever, dude. All right, man. Here's what we're going to do. Whatever, dude. All right, so just turn here. around for me. Let me put your hands. Up. I'm just detaining both of you till we figure out what's going on. All right, I'll have a talk with both of you guys here in just a minute. We're not gonna worry about those names because we know those names aren't right. All right. I want you to have a seat right here beside your friend. All right, go ahead and have a seat for me. Right. Have a seat for me. All right, here's here's what's going on, guys. Okay. All right, Mr. Dust, you're the one that owns the vehicle, okay? Your license is expired, okay? Which I think you know, which is why you're, uh, you got your friend driving. And I also noticed the odor of alcohol coming from you, okay? All right. You, however, your license is suspended. Did you know his license was suspended? Oh, 
Ooh, that sounds like something you two are going to have to work out. But uh, your driver's license is suspended, okay? So you can't be driving at all, period. Your license is expired, and you shouldn't be driving. However, an expired license is not that bad, all right? Uh, the computer is not telling me how long it's been expired, so we won't go there on that. Okay, so why don't you do me a favor and go ahead and stand up for me. Do you have anything on your person that might stick me, poke me, stab me? Uh, any needles, hand grenades, rocket launchers, anything like that? You're not sure? Alright, let me pat you down real quick. If everything checks out with you, I'm going to release you. Uh, and because the driver is under arrest, I will be uh, searching the vehicle. Okay, so nothing of any importance on him. All right, man, go ahead and have a seat for me. All right, buddy, why don't you go ahead and stand up, man? You are not the one that I wanted to stand up. Let's walk you over here. Why don't you walk over here for me? All right, there you go. Just go ahead and uh, have a seat right there. All right, man, why don't you go ahead and hop up for me? All right, do you have anything on you that might stick me, poke me, stab me, make me bleed, make me mad, needles, hand grenades, rocket launchers, uh, mountains, trees, buses, planes, anything like that? You all know? All right. Make sure his partner ain't trying to get up behind me. Matches, sunglasses, and a plane ticket. Okay. All right, so nothing illegal on him. All right. All right. You are going to be going to jail today for driving on suspended license, so I'm going to go ahead and walk you over here to the car. Back the fuck up, man. Let's go ahead and... Yeah, you... There we go. Oh, look at that. That animation is much better. Awesome. All right, man. Um, also, with the odor of alcohol I'm getting from the vehicle, do you, have you had anything to drink today? If you would, just go ahead and blow into this tube for me until you hear the beep. Keep blowing, keep blowing, keep blowing, keep blowing. All right. Nothing. All right, awesome. All right, just sit tight for me. You sit over there for a minute. I'm gonna search the vehicle. And I haven't taken the Illinois plates out yet either. Right, let's search this. See if there's anything in here that there shouldn't be. This guy's just like, film the police. I'm watching the police. Several cans of spray paint, a tourist map, nothing. Okay. All right. So. Just trying to hang on until tomorrow. I hear you, buddy. All right. So I'm gonna do a breathalyzer on him. Let's go ahead and stand up for me. If his breathalyzer comes back fine, I'm going to release him with the car. Uh, there's nothing illegal in the car, but I did smell an odor of alcohol from somebody, so we're going to test it. All right, man. You can take a portable breathalyzer test. So if you would, just go ahead and blow into the end of this for me. Thank you. And you are well over the legal limit. All right, so here's what's going to happen. All right, you're over the legal limit to be driving. However, you weren't driving. Okay, so I'm not going to arrest you for DUI. I'm not even going to arrest you, okay? I'm going to let you go, but you can't take the car, okay? So why don't you just go ahead and have a seat for me. We're going to get the car towed. That way he can't try to get in it afterward. You know you can go, dude. You don't have to stand right there and watch me. I mean, unless that's what you like doing. 1637, can I get an available tow truck to my location for this uh, great Huntley? It's going to be at the corner of Bay City Avenue and Adventure Court. You good, dude? You you can go, man. Stay out of trouble. I didn't mean it. Sorry. No, you're fine, bro. All right, so the car has been towed. Oh, hi there. This guy's just gonna. All right, go ahead and stand up for me, man. No, I missed the last Parkers and Swingers game. All right, here's what's gonna happen. I'm gonna go ahead and cut you loose, cause you didn't break any laws. I mean, you're drunker than a skunk, but. Not illegal in any sense because you weren't driving. Consider this a warning. So you're good to go, man. This report a Grand Theft Auto in progress in the Spooky Canal. He is probably very upset with uh, local law enforcement. Let's uh, see if we can't scoot my car over a little bit more. All right, 1637. Can I get an available uh, transport unit to my location? Assistance Same required Bay City for Avenue a suspect placed under arrest in the Spooky Canal. These people wouldn't Got find their way out of a bag. paper bag. Roger.
All right, so they're here to get him, and uh, once they get him, we will head on out on patrol and find something else to get into. Hey. 1637, you show me clear off this call. I'll be code 4, 10, 8, and available. Car behind me. Man, he's he's being crazy. real impatient. No? Already, already. And he didn't. Hey, what's going on, brother? 1637 radio. 28 San Andreas 20 Lima Delta X ray 609. Target stop real quick. 20 Lincoln David X ray 609. No 1099. Stand by. Mm. Alright, 1637 radio. Show me on a traffic stop of the vehicle. We're going to be northbound Doma Street, uh, just past Aguia Street. It's going to be on a dark blue Huntley, occupied one time. Right, let's see what this guy's problem is. He's in such a hurry. Like, he was tailgating and all kinds of stuff. So let's see what his issue is. How you doing, buddy? I'm Officer Garth, Los Santos Police Department. The reason I'm stopping you today is because my alarm is going off, because that happens. The reason I'm stopping you today, okay, is because you're tailgating and weaving and all over all over the stuff kind of aggressively behind me, okay? You have your driver's license, registration, prevention, or something? All right, Mr. Barrett, uh, have you had anything to drink today? Okay, all right, you like to stay hydrated, no big deal. Do you have anything illegal in the vehicle? No? Alright. Alright, just sit tight for me. I'm gonna run some stuff on the computer and I'll be right back with you, okay? Alright. The way he was driving was a little suspicious, so... We're gonna... See what the deal is. Nothing. And everything is good there. So I'm going to run a breathalyzer on him. Make sure he's not drunk. And, uh... Let's see what's going on there. Alright, man. Um, since you admitted to staying hydrated, uh, everything came back fine on your insurance information and stuff like that. So what I'd like uh, to do is to have you take a portable breathalyzer test for me just to determine whether or not you've had anything to drink tonight since you admitted to staying hydrated. Uh, it's just normal procedure, no big deal. So if you would for me, just go ahead and blow into the end of this tube until you hear the beep. If everything's all good, we'll let you go. Keep blowing, keep blowing, keep blowing, keep blowing. Okay. Alright, everything's fine there. No big deal. Um, I'm gonna cut you with a warning. Just uh, try to try not to tailgate, weave in and out, and stuff like that. Okay? All right. Awesome. Have a good day, man. Go on, you idiot. Get out of here. Go on, you idiot. Get out of here. All right, so we gave you a warning. 1637 radio. You can show me clear on my traffic stop. I'll be uh, code four and ten eight slash ten seven. What the? Alright guys, that's going to do it for this episode of LSPDFR. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, slap the crap out of that like button. Let me know what you think about everything. And let me know what you think about the most confusing police episode ever with uh, blue lighted Phoenix based police and down by the beach. So, you guys have a great one and I'll see you in the next video. Till then, take care guys.